BREAM is a set of standards and certification schemes that measure and certify sustainable value in the built environment. Achieving a standard involves meeting a set of, in many cases, very detailed criteria. While this detail is essential, it should not be forgotten that there are sound principles underpinning them. These are, number one, BREAM delivers sustainable solutions. Number two, it provides a framework to get the balance right. Number three, it is based on sound science. Number four, it supports a process of change. And number five, ultimately it delivers value to the occupants of the building. The first principle is that BREAM delivers sustainable solutions. When many people hear the word sustainability, they think of the environment. But a sustainable solution is simply one that works now and for a long time in the future. And is a solution that works in every respect not just environmentally. The triple bottom line of sustainability includes social, economic and environmental impacts, and a successful development will address all three. In BREAM, environmental sustainability also covers a wide spectrum and is not just about saving energy. Environmental categories include areas such as pollution, ecology, materials, waste, water and transport. BREAM encourages developments that align with economic needs on a wider community level and supports cost-effective solutions by encouraging long-term thinking over the full life cycle of the buildings, not just the construction. Its process also creates a framework for a considered approach, leading to increased efficiency and collaboration. And BREAM rewards buildings that best serve the occupants keeping them healthy and providing the services and facilities required in and around the building. From keeping people thermally comfortable to providing easy access to transportation, BREAM buildings allow occupants to flourish. So the second principle is that BREAM provides a new model or framework, one that includes key factors for a sustainable world within it and will help to steer away from major problems towards solutions that work longer term. BREAM does this by creating a weighted, balanced scorecard which addresses a broad range of concerns of sustainability in buildings to help shift away from the unsustainable business-as-usual models. The third principle is that BREAM is based on sound science, the latest scientific and building research. BREAM has access to a broad range of industry and scientific experts and has extensive consultations in evolving new versions of BREAM schemes. These include official technical steering groups and a standing panel of experts. The BREAM Core Technical Standard is at the heart of our code for a sustainable built environment. Principle 4 is that BREAM supports a process of change by recognising and rewarding best practice that go beyond building regulations and issue certificates as proof of compliance. It provides a framework for governments and organisations to set direction, lead and reward progress, leading to real change, as well as increased reputation and marketability for those organisations. It also provides a framework for creating rapid change and innovation. Feedback is needed on every level, and the BREAM process can provide this and support best practice in developers, contractors, architects, builders, and most importantly, occupiers, via post-occupancy feedback. Our increasingly standardised key performance indicators, or KPIs, support monitoring and tracking of relative performance in buildings, leading to accelerated change. And finally, BREAM ultimately aims to deliver real and demonstrable value to the occupants or owners of the building. A building that works, that meets the needs of the occupants or owners, helps them flourish, is cost-effective over the life of the building, and that operates within the limits of the Earth's finite resources. Whether a new building being created, or the continued development or running of an existing building, BREAM can help individuals and businesses manage the risk associated with their buildings, increase sales or lettings value, increase levels of corporate social responsibility, and better environments for employees all contribute to long-term value. BREAM schemes all reward reduced consumption of resources, cost efficiency and the creation of a healthy, productive internal environment. Individual criteria stretch from energy efficiency, service life planning and costing, transportation links and waste processes 
to stakeholder participation, good daylighting, air quality, thermal comfort and acoustics. This is why we believe that these five principles mean that Bream can help deliver real and sustainable value in the built environment.